As you can see in the video, a male patient who have collapsed wanted to be saved by the surrounding crowd. Is experiencing more trauma because not a single one knows proper CPR. This video aims to teach each and every one of us whether you are a medical professional or ordinary person. This video is for you. Scene safety. Check if the scene is safe. Remove any possible source of danger away from the patient. If you are taking your life safety exam, you must actively show or perform the act of checking the scene, just like what I'm doing. Introduce yourself. This is a part of asking patient consent. Regardless of who the patient is, you must always introduce yourself and ask permission. For example, I am Babu Randall. I am a trained first aider. Can I help? Check for responsiveness. Gently tap the shoulders of the patient while talking it loud or sudden voice to catch the patient's attention. Do not shake or move the patient to avoid any additional or possible injury. Hey sir, hey sir, do you hear me? Hey sir, hey sir, do you hear me? If your patient is unresponsive or unconscious, activate medical assistance. Please take note of the following scenarios if you are alone. If the patient is suffering from a breathing emergency, attend first to your patient before activating medical assistance. This is referred to as the care first scenario. If the patient is suffering from cardiac emergency, activate first medical assistance. This is referred to as call first scenario. Hey sir with white t-shirt, can you call a local emergency hotline number? Check airway. Use the head tilt chin maneuver. Hyperextend the patient's head. Place your nearest hand on your patient's forehead and gently tilt in his head back. With your fingertips under the point of the victim's chin, lift the chin to open the airway. Look for the presence of any obstruction in patient's mouth. If there is any, remove it using your pointing finger for adults or pinky finger for infants. You can remove the obstruction either away or towards from you. Check breathing. Use the technique look, listen, and feel or LLF. Look for chest movement. Observe for the rise and fall of the patient's chest. Listen at the patient's mouth for the breath sounds. Feel for air on your cheek. Please take note to perform look, listen, and feel for no more than 10 seconds to determine whether the patient is breathing normally. C for check circulation. Check for severe bleeding or shock. If there is any, treat first the bleeding. If there is none, continue patient assessment. Check for the patient's pulse using your two fingers in the carotid area. Please take note that you may perform checking breathing and circulation at the same time if there are no signs of bleeding and shock. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, four one thousand, five one thousand, six one thousand, seven one thousand, eight one thousand, nine one thousand, ten. Based on your assessment. If patient is negative pulse, negative breathing, perform CPR. If positive pulse, negative breathing, perform rescue breathing. If negative pulse, positive breathing, reassess the patient. Please take note of the following when performing CPR. Push hard, push fast. 
Place your hands on the top of the other in the middle of the chest. Use your body weight to help you administer compressions that are at least 2 inches deep and delivered at a rate of at least 100 compression per minute. Deliver Rescue Bets When a person's head tilted back slightly and the chin lifted, pinch the nose shut and place your mouth over the person's mouth to make a complete seal. Blow into the person's mouth to make the chest rise. Deliver two rescue breaths, then continue compressions. If the chest does not rise with the initial rescue breath, retilt the head before delivering the second breath. If the chest doesn't rise with the second breath, the person may be choking. After each subsequent set of 30 chest compression, and before attempting breaths, look for an object, and if seen, remove it. Continue CPR steps. Keep performing cycles of chest compressions and breathing until the person exhibits signs of life, such as breathing, an AED becomes available, or EMS or trained medical responders arrives on scene. Note, end the cycles if the scene becomes unsafe or you cannot continue performing CPR due to exhaustion. You may use your dominant hand or non-dominant hand over the other. Locate the center of the chest For adults, the center of the chest is located in between the hams itself. Always look at the patient's face. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 1. Then give two blows. Pinch the nose, blow, release. Pinch the nose, blow, release. Second cycle. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 2. Pinch to the nose, then blow, release. Pinch to the nose, then blow release 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 3 pinch to the nose blow release pinch to the nose blow release 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 4. The nose blow, release, pinch the nose, blow, release. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 5. Pinch the nose, blow, release, pinch the nose, blow, release. Quick assess breathing and circulation. 1, 1,000, 2, 1,000, 3, 1,000, 4, 1,000, 5, 1,000, 6, 1,000, 7, 1,000, 8, 1,000, 9, 1,000, 10. Now your patient is positive pulse, positive breathing. Perform the secondary assessment. Extend the arm nearest you at the right angle to their body with their palm facing up. Take their other arm and fold it so the back of their hand rests on the cheek closest to you and hold it in place. Use your free hand to bend the person's knee farthest from you to the right angle. Make sure their bent leg is at the right angle. Carefully roll the person onto their side by pulling on the bent knee. Their bent arm should be supporting the head and their extended arm will stop you rolling them too far. Stay with the person and monitor their condition until help arrives. Open the airway by gently tilting their hand back and lifting their chin and check that nothing is blocking their airway. Don'ts of CPR Massaging Avoid massaging by pointing your fingers down into the patient's body. The fingers need to be interlaced 
or the one hand on top of the other with fingers extended off the patient's chest as the force of compression is driven through the heel of the hand. Double Closer Do not interchange your hands during the cycle. You may interchange your hands after every cycle. Jerker Do not forget to push hard push fast. Make sure to have full recoil when performing compressions. Bouncing Avoid bouncing your hands need to stay in contact with the patient's chest during compression. Chismoser Concentrate in performing proper CPR. Do not chat with co-rescuer or anyone unnecessarily. Stargazer Focus your attention on the patient. Do not be distracted by unnecessary events happening around you. Bender Don't bend your arms. Keep them as straight as possible. This is because your arm muscle tire much quicker than body weight. Keeping the arms straight helps that your body weight drives the compression down and maintain proper dip. Check if the scene is safe. Introduce yourself. Check for responsiveness. Activate medical assistance. Check for airway. Check for breathing and circulation for not more than 10 seconds. Patient is negative pulse, negative breathing, perform CPR. Perform proper CPR. Push hard, push fast. Correct depth of compression. Maintain compression rate of 100 to 120 per minute. Allow full chest recoil after each compression. Minimize interruptions. Avoid overventilation. Take note. If you are taking your life safety exam, you must do the full cycle. After full cycles, quickly check for breathing and circulation. If negative pulse, negative breathing, continue CPR. If positive pulse, positive breathing, proceed to secondary assessment.